be making basics. What's going on YouTube? Beat Making Basics back again with another dope video. If you're new to my channel, please do me a favor and go ahead and subscribe as well as give me a like on the video. Uh, without further ado, let's jump into today's content. What I'm going to be doing is showing you how to make consistent bangers and save time in the process. Okay, How do you make a consistent banger and save time in the process? Now, the way you're going to do this is through creating a template. OK, I know that might not be what you wanted to hear, but a template is going to save you time and help you to make a consistent type of beat. You know what I'm saying? Consistent banger. So, for instance, what I have here, what a template is going to be is basically um, basically what you'll do is you'll pick out sounds. OK, pull up some sounds that you like and you're going to save these as a template. So, for instance, like I picked out a melody that I like. I went to a quick sampler, create a quick sampler track. And then I, I drug in an 808 that I liked. And uh, this like whatever eight look, whatever samples that you like, you just want to create another track and then load that sample and then save that sample um, in here. So this is a kick. clap right here hi hats open but anyway you get the idea here even with the um, you know which different instruments so like I have this omnisphere plug in and I have this bass pulled up got this choir sound pulled up Okay, so I even went as far as putting like a, an adaptive limiter on the stereo out. Basically, I have this, um, I have a negative 0.1 dB setting on it, gain at 3, 3 dB. But anyway, yeah, you want to just pretty much set everything up that you want in your track and then, or just the sounds that you, you, you know you use all the time. And then you'll just come over here to foul and go as save as template. And then you're just gonna give it a name and it's gonna save right here and then you can always pull it up. So like say if I wanted to create a new track, I could go new from template. I'm gonna say don't close. And then I, I have these two different templates here. I can create multiple templates and this is gonna be the way you make bangers. So like for instance, since I had this template up and I know I, I usually make bangers right here with these uh, sounds now it's going to be easy for me to cook up so I can come over here and I can come over here and turn this metronome and I can cook up here easily And it just makes the whole process, you know, you're going to save time. It makes the whole process simple because. I come over here to clap.
from over here now. Grab a melody off of here. Man, where was that the thing I just, you know? Anyway, that other melody man but for some reason I lost that joint I'm about to find that mug man where is that joint
All right, y'all. So the point of this is by having like the drums already loaded up, it saved me time with having to look for certain drums um, by having like, you know, different things already on here, like the mix already done. You know, like basically what I did here is on a beat that I already had done. I pretty much saved as a different session and deleted the beat. And so I already had my sounds that I wanted, okay, in here. I was like, man, this is a hard beat. I like the sound selection. And so I already had the sounds, everything. And then basically I just did what I told you. I did the save as and uh, saved as a template, named it. And now like anytime I want to make a type of beat like this, like a trap type of vibe or whatever, I have the 808 kick, snares. I have everything already accessed, right? already plugged in. And then all I had to do is either make a loop or pull in a loop from either a producer I'm working with or from Splice or something like that. So it just makes things a whole lot easier. It makes the process of making bangers a whole lot easier. This beat actually turned out fire. So I'm actually going to keep on making this beat, man. Click on the next video. Probably I might do like a um, arrangement, beat arrangement, how to arrange trap beats super fast um, in Elijah Pro 10 in the next video. But anyway, th thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.